Allie, welcome to Snap Math. Thank you for sending in your question tonight. So this is, we're taking the limit as n approaches infinity of um, 5 over n times the sum of tangent of 2 of ni over, or 5i over n as n, or summed from 1 to n. So the easiest way to do this is, so since we're multiplying these things, we're going to look at this limit right here. So as the n goes to infinity, this actually goes to 0. So if we go 0 times the limit of n goes to infinity, so we just separated these two things. Let me show you. The limit of n of infinity of 5 over n times the limit of n as it goes to infinity, and then we take the sum from 1 to n of the tangent to 5i. So now it's a little bit easier to see. What we're going to do, we're just going to evaluate this one. And that is actually, as n goes to infinity, this limit goes to 0. So now what we have is this times the limit of n as it goes to infinity, but of the sum. But what's anything times 0? Anything times 0 is just going to equal 0, so our limit up here is going to equal 0. This is little tricky, but if you break it up like that, it's going to be a little bit easier to see what we're doing. And you don't even have to evaluate this part of the limit. All right. Thank you for sending in your question, and we look forward to answering more of your questions in the future. Have a good night.